Hey guys, Allie Owens here. I will be racing for Obiker Racing on September 9th, next Friday at Richmond. I am super excited to be counting down the days. Um, this morning I, is a little bit different than our typical scheduled Saturdays at my house. Um, my grandfather's still in the hospital. He's in the ICU, so we are up here spending some quality time with him and just talking and reflecting back on everything over the years. So I have uh, my mom here. And hi. Hi. <laughs> I chopped my hair off to be like my mom, can't you tell? <laughs> I get my go a little shorter. <laughs> uh, no, I get my awesome style from my mom. Um, anyway, I just wanted to. We were just sitting here talking, and I'm like, we need to go live for people to to see and and um, get to know us. So I'll let her chat. And I'm not really a live person, <laughs> but everybody in our inner circle is gonna know what this means. But I think I had the slogan before Budweiser because here we go. Oh my gosh, my mom's so weird. <laughs> okay, so sometimes maybe the corniness that comes out of my mouth also comes from her. <laughs> but really, here we go. Wally, Jerry, here we go. <laughs> She's a little, a little crazy. Sorry. No. Um, yeah. No. You have to tell people about, I don't know, what do you want to talk about? Well, I don't know. It was the first, um, it was our first race, right? And we were sitting on pit road waiting for you to do your... Hot laps. Qualifying. Or you're qualifying. I'm in the wrong thing. Hot laps. <laughs> what was that? Volusia Speedway? No. What? New Smyrna. Hot laps. I'm at the yes. wrong track. <laughs> <laughs> it's, been a, it's been a long 28 years. Sorry. <laughs> so anyway, we're sitting on pit road and everybody's just waiting and waiting for Allie. And I had my earphones on and I'm listening to the radio. Her racing headset. Not, yeah. Not earphones. Did I say earphones? Yeah. Sorry. I had <laughs> She's been away from the racetrack <laughs> too long. <laughs> so I'm sitting on the pit road wall and nobody else has their headphones on. Headset. Headset. <laughs> <laughs> Let me say what I want to say. Okay, okay, okay. It is what it is to me. <laughs> Okay, we're full of giggles today. Okay, go ahead. So you're sitting so on anyway, the pit wall. I'm sitting on the pit wall, and all of a sudden it's her time, and I'm like, here we go. No, here. it wasn't even like that. It was yeah. much louder on the video. that they, re they recorded her because everybody else could hear each other. But I just have to say, it wasn't on the Budweiser billboards yet, so I said that first. <laughs> <laughs> branding, people. It's all about the branding. <laughs> See you later. All right, moving on to the, my next family member. She, you know, and this is my mom's mom, my grandma, so whatever comes out of her mouth, you could probably just see the generation line, and, and I was just doomed from the get-go. But <laughs> here's my grandma. Hi, I'm Allie's grandma, and she came to visit with me for a few hours when she was about seven years old. And we went out to the swing, to the recreation area, and we were just swinging and having a little private conversation between her and I and started talking about what she wanted to do for the rest of her life. Well, mm -hmm. out of her mouth come that she wanted to be a veterinarian. <laughs> and I thought that was a pretty good goal, seeing how everybody in the family loves animals. But now here we are all these years later and she is a race car driver and mm -hmm. we couldn't be prouder of her. Aww, thank, thank you. Thanks, Grandma. <laughs> Moving on. So we have family in from Illinois because I am from Southern Illinois. So um, my mom's cousin, so she would be my second cousin. There we go. Yep. So I'm learning, I'm, you know, we got family all over the place. Anyway. <laughs> This is Lori. Hi, everybody. I'm Lori. I'm Allie's um, second cousin, Sherry's first cousin. Sherry and I are same age, so kind of grew up like sisters <laughs> and uh, had our babies. She started a little ahead of me, but... <laughs> <laughs> So she gives me a lot of advice. So I'm anxiously waiting to uh, become a grandparent too. So and have some nice. great granddaughters or grandsons like she does. So what do you think <laughs> about the racing stuff? Very excited about her racing. <laughs> and my 10 year old son's really excited about her <laughs> racing because he loves to watch the race cars. So um, <laughs> we're really excited. We'll be rooting her on the whole time. <laughs> so we got a lot of support already. Next up is the man of the hour. 
by Grandpa Bowsman. I know um, a lot of you guys follow me on um, Facebook already and Twitter and Instagram and all the other fun stuff. Um, my Grandpa Rick is huge into social media, so you guys probably follow him on your own. But um, he's been like a huge advocate of everything that we've done so far. And for him to be in the hospital, I really appreciate everybody showing him love and support. So I'm going to let him talk to you a little bit about what he thinks about going racing again. And, uh, oh yeah, every nurse and every doctor in this hospital knows about Allie Owens and a biker racing and that all the channels and all the TVs in this hospital better be on NBC Sports, um, next Friday to watch this race. Oh, and he had to download the app on his iPad just in case the hospital doesn't have the race so he could watch it. So this is my grandpa. Uh, good morning. Uh, I, I went through, uh, watching Allie go through. Uh, BMX and go-kart racing, local track racing, which she won a race at 13, and uh, into the Wayland Series, the ARCA Series, and they're very proud to see her going into the Xfinity Series and the Obaka Racing Team. Mm -hmm. So we're looking forward to see how she does. Thank thanks, guys, for listening. <laughs> so anyway, this is what my Saturday morning... Um, is like before the next week of racing so anyway I look like a hot mess because I'm in mom mode my kids are probably at home ready to you know tear yeah tear DJ um, to pieces and make the house a total mess so I will be leaving here shortly going to the house trying to get that organized get my kids ready um, for the day and we have a lot to do because this is the last weekend before we go to Richmond so we're going to be packing to head to North Carolina to go to the shop and get fitted for the seat so there's a lot of stuff to do um, you know on the back end still for the racing um, and just knowing that our family is still kind of going through a hard time here with my grandpa in the hospital there's a lot of different directions that we're all being pulled in but um, you know everything's possible because of your guys support and um, you know everything that is through social media and all the kind words everybody in my family sees so it's not just me that you're rooting for and pushing through there's a lot of other people that are you know really appreciative for your guys' support so I will see you next week in the 97 oh bike a Chevrolet for the next Series, and I will talk to you soon. Bye, guys.